South Korean and Japanese fighter planes overshadow Russian 295 and Su-35 bombers. Jakarta Greater.com, Japanese Marshall Air Force, JASCF, and Republic of Korea ROKAF fighter planes were flown to intercept two Russian 295 MS bombers. An early warning aircraft of Berea A-50 and the Suhoi Su-35 multi-role fighter which made a 10-hour flight over the Sea of Japan and the East China Sea on November 27. The Russian Ministry of Defense released and was launched by the diplomat. Two 295 MS strategic bombers from the Air Force carried out planned flights in neutral waters of the Sea of Japan in the East China Sea, said a statement from the Ministry of Defense. During its flight, long-range bombers were escorted by Su-35S fighter jets and Russian Air Force's A-50 long-range radar surveillance aircraft. The flight lasts more than 10 hours. The Defense Ministry also acknowledged that Japanese and South Korean warplanes were guarding Russian aircraft as part of its air patrol in Asian waters. At several stages of the flight route, the crew of the 295MS aircraft was overshadowed by a pair of F-15 and F-16 fighters and F-2 warplanes, the TASS news agency quoted the Russian Ministry as saying. The Japanese Ministry of Defense confirmed that its fighter jets intercepted two 295 MS bombers today. Last month, Japanese and South Korean fighter jets intercepted six Russian military aircraft, including two strategic 295 MS bombers that entered the Japan Air Defense Identification Zone (JADIZ) zone in South Korean Air Defense Identification Zones KADIZ, Identification Zone or defenses are not considered sovereign or territorial airspace. According to the Joint Chiefs of Staff of the Republic of Korea Armed Forces JCS, it marked the 20th violation of KADIZ without prior notice by Russian military aircraft. In July, a Berea of A-50 aircraft violated South Korean airspace. According to JSC, Joint Chiefs of Staff, the plane entered South Korean airspace twice above Dokdo Island. The South Korean Air Force flew the F-15K and F-16K in response and fired 20 flares and 360 machine gun bullets as warning shots after the A-50 purportedly ignored repeated radio warnings. Russia strongly rejects allegations that its aircraft violated South Korean airspace. The July incident occurred during the first Joint Strategic Air Patrol of the Chinese People's Liberation Army Plop Air Force and the Russian Air Force in East Asia. The Japanese Air Force also sent fighter jets in response to Joint Air Patrols to intercept and shadow Chinese and Russian bombers. Source, Jakarta Greater.